Welcome everybody. This video is a bit of a tutorial on how to make Minecraft run faster. There are a few out there, but they want you to use Optifine and sort of just like remove a bunch of features that make Minecraft Minecraft, like removing the sky or whatever. But what? You don't want to remove the sky. You, you need to know when it's daytime. So here are a few things that you can get. You can get this right here. You can go to this website. You can go down here and you can download the latest version of LWJGL. Yes. This stuff, Minecraft, it doesn't seem Minecraft updates this stuff itself, I don't think. Uh, because, like, whenever you get the newest version, it always it seems to run faster. At least it does seem to for me. Um, so you just download it and just get right there. Then you click here because that'll make it run faster, go faster. Or you can just wait, but whatever. All right, and then you open it up. You go to your app data through Run. You go. You gotta use Run. Then you type in app data. Hit OK. Roaming. Dot Minecraft. Bin. And you'll see a few jar files here. You go with the jar here. You see these. You will see these. These are what come with Minecraft. You want to find the ones in here copy paste them into there I accidentally hit don't copy but don't matter I already have them and then what you gotta do is you go to Optifine Optifine you said you still use it because even if you don't change anything in the options it still makes Minecraft run faster next you need to update the natives files Inside that same folder, you'll find also a native file right under jar. You go into there, then go into your corresponding operating system, which mine is Windows. Go into natives for your Minecraft dot bin, or dot Minecraft bin, and then just copy everything over. In Zen, then you go into your video settings, video settings. This should be on fast. Uh, if your computer can handle it, you can have this up to 100 because it makes Minecraft look a lot prettier. But if you cannot handle it, you can just have that all the way down to zero. It don't really matter. Render distance, I recommend to go on normal. And then, but I can handle fast, or far rather. Have this on max FPS. This should be on fast. And then if you have a multi-core system, like a dual core, quad core, you know, that kind of stuff. Then you can have a multi-core chunk loading, which will make chunk loading faster and uh, reduce your lag. Anti-aliasing can be off. It'll not really change much, but it should make you go faster. If you so desire, you could turn off stars as well, because that's not really a necessary thing, you know. It's not really necessary, but I don't like to turn that off. Stars is nice. Cloud height, you can turn the clouds just completely off, if you have to. It'll help a lot with your frames per second if you turn smoke off as well, because then, like, if you have a bunch of torches up, it's not going to lag your game as much, because there's usually a lot of smoke particles coming up. Also, you could turn flames off, but you don't want to... Turn smooth FPS on and smooth world on. Those help with FPS stabilization. And then, finally, if you have a really crap computer and it still lags a lot, I recommend not having a higher resolution texture pack than 16, because 16 is the default. And the higher resolution you go, the more it's going to lag, because the more it has to load in. And then your game should run pretty smooth. Usually, I couldn't really run this in Minecraft with recording and at full screen, and at far, and with, you know with all the smooth lighting. But I'm still running it at a good 30 frames per second. It's not too bad considering. And, it's, and when you turn cloud height off, it doesn't turn off the clouds. You still see clouds like I am now. I have cloud height off. And so, yeah. It still runs pretty darn nice if you just do those settings that I told you to and update those files, those jar files up, uh, up there. And that's it. That's how you make Minecraft run faster. It's not that hard. Don't take much steps. And it works. At least for me, and for my sister's computer, it works, and her computer is crap. So, I uh, hope you've all enjoyed, and if you are 
enjoying the video, then maybe you could subscribe or hit the like button. I wonder. It's not that hard. It's just a little click. So, yeah. See you all next time.